Well, howdy there, Eternal. How are you doing this fine, slimy day? Mitty! Hi, Mitty. How are you? How are all the people today? All right, let's get in place. Did too much today, still sore. I worked out not 45 minutes ago. I am also sore. Glad to hear you're doing good, Mitty. You have a fun day? I think it was a Bones Day today, wasn't it? Let's see if it's uh if it's awake today. Hey, it is. Ooh, donuts. God, I really want a donut. Oh, I could go for an old fashioned. Oh, I want them sour cream donuts. Oh, give me a donut. That's a sound bite right there, isn't that? I'm gonna have to clip that for later. <laughs> what kind of donuts did you get? And Eternal, what have you been up to today? You said you did too much. Too much of what? Too much being cool? Too much shopping? What are you shopping for? Food shopping. Oh. Can't have enough food shopping. Well, maybe you can have too much food. Too much food shopping. Let's get into this. Because I think, I think, we're just about done. And then as soon as we're done, we jump into Pyre. Let's try it. Let's sleep. Hey, Shadow. Perfect. Look at everyone having a time. Having a good time, having a good time. Let's kick today off with a nice vacuum. Rue it. Rue it. Nice little sucky. You spent 469. Nice. 87 on munchies today. Man, that is a lot of food. What all did you end up getting? Also, do you go weekly or is that like a bi weekly thing? Once a month. Oh, it's monthly. Okay, that makes sense. I'd probably spend about that much in a month. We don't have the freezer space to store everything for that long, so we usually end up going weekly. Probably end up spending more in gas than we want to, but, you know, what can you do?
Huey. Oh, close. It was just a Huey. I wonder if I can, do I have another? I do not. A fashion pod remover? You were again planning on watching last stream because your poor internet that day, and again you did not? <laughs> That's okay, Shadow. We, uh, we are getting quite close, I do believe, to the end. So I'm just kind of biding my time till I get that last little bit. Uh, what does it take? Royal Jelly. That's why I couldn't get another one. That makes sense. Royal Jelly for everything. I hate it. Hopefully your internet behaves a little bit more for you today. Huh, they're taking care of food. Uh, yeah, let's, let's just sell these. And was there something in here? No. Where was it? What did I need to buy? I think it was just buying more 7z rewards, right? Yeah, the decorizer. A slime trophy, huh? What is a decorizer? Is it this? I don't think so. I wonder if it's something I have to build? Twitch is telling you to redeem your 5,000 points. Now, I'll let you know now, Lauren is uh, on a, she's home, but she's at book club. She's doing book club right now. So she, uh, she would not be able to jump in. Also, hey, Chris Hopper, how are you? Good to see you. Welcome back. What do we get? The decorizer? Is it decorations? I kind of want to get all these lamps. I have enough to build, like, all of these. Let's do it. Oh, I don't have pepper jam? Where do I get pepper jam? Man, everything needs royal slimes. That's ridiculous. <gasps> Thank you. That is very smooth and light. Not as viscous as I remember it being. <sighs> that is a brew of my own concoction. <laughs> No, this isn't Hades, but as soon as we get the last letter, Bryce, we're uh, we're gonna jump into Pyre, which brings us one game closer to Hades. Uh, and after Pyre, I think it's Psychonauts, and then it's Hades. Then we finally do the Hades. I have no idea where the decorizer went. I'd have figured it was something out here. But I ain't seeing nothing. Wait, is this it? Oh, it's right here. Oh. Okay. It just allows me to pick up all the stuff that I decorate my my place with. There's a letter. From Casey. I think this is it. No outer wilds gem somewhere in the middle there. Do you want Outer Wilds to postpone Hades? Life is different now. I had a year to think about things while you slept on your way across the stars. I think it almost scared me when things got easier, and when I finally realized that what we each have now is what we wanted all along. Because if you're still the girl that I know, you're happy out there on the very farthest frontier. And I hope the happiness you feel now lasts forever. I hope that the sunsets over there are as gorgeous as they are over here, and that if you search far enough, on a rainy day, some rancher out there has a taco stand you can visit. 
I realize that last one probably isn't likely to happen, but uh, it would sure be romantic, right? I'm glad to have shared a part of me with you, Beatrix LeBeau, and I'm happy to know that maybe one of those stars I see up there in the sky is you. Is that it? Now she's just depressed and sleeping all day. Not sure what this game is, but you're gonna pretend it's Borderlands meets Animal Crossing and you can't change my mind? I mean, I would not say you are far off. Um, you've got rowdy, rambunctious slimes who won't eat. Where'd you go? Uh, and they drop plorts and it's a wasteland. Uh, everything's out to kill you. I mean, look at this. Look at how crazy this is. I have giant pancake devils. They're honey dervish slimes. They're like whirlwind honey slimes. Oh, where do you think you're going? Get back in there with your friends. They're all so very cute. Uh, yeah, so it's Slime Rancher, and the name of the game is to ranch slimes. And, uh, the more you ranch them, the richer you become, and, you know, you left uh, everything and everyone you ever knew in the world to uh, come out here and pursue the life of slime ranching and slimeology. That's so very cute. It's a very cute game. It's a nice, chill game. If you like games like Stardew Valley or Graveyard Keeper or Harvest Moon, anything like that, this would be a great game for you. Hey. Calm down. You get in here. And you eat some food. All of y'all take a chill pill. If you don't have a chill pill, take a chill strip. Put it on your tongue, dissolves, chill. We're just making bank. Uh, let's buy that slime trophy. I want to see what that is. Oh! Oh my god, it's so cute! Look at this! It's big, and it's gold, and it's got a chicken right- th Oh. It's got a chicken right there, at the right time of day. Oh, I love it. That's amazing. Next is just more colors. Another tour. Hi, B. There's another tour coming up, and I have a feeling that this will be the one. So here I am, packing my bags and thinking of you. Maybe this is how it felt when you were leaving for your big adventure. Lots of excitement, lots of butterflies. And even though I know you're so far away, I keep thinking that maybe I'll catch you somewhere out there in the crowd. If that ever happens, I promise I'll sing a song for you. It wouldn't be the first time. That day, Beatrix took a moment to reflect. She thought about Hobson and Thora, and the adventures she'd had exploring the far, far range. But most of all, she thought of Casey, and wondered where life would, make, would take her next. Oh, please don't say that you'll go. My heart can't bear the news. Just knowing that you'll be a thousand light years away. I was not expecting a sung song. And will you know when it's through? Digging it when you find what you Oh my god, it's a honey slime! Look at that cute little guy. I feel like we should just, you know. Good job sliming them around. Thank you. I worked real hard to slime them ranches. And I slimed them good. 
I did Slimans. Made a lot of discoveries. I found an ancient portal that we could not activate. Uh, so I, I looked that up, Shadow, because I was curious too how, like, what brought the game to its end. People speculated that it was going to be DLC, but I don't think... I don't think they ever released DLC when it came to the portal. I think, in the end, the portal or the door at the end that would take you elsewhere or spin up the engines of the planet or whatever, I think it was supposed to be that moment of reflection. Uh to make you ponder which door you are going to choose. I don't think I don't think they wanted to really give you the option of one door or the other, but they wanted you to think on that. They wanted to leave it uh, I guess a little open-ended. Which I'm a little sad. I would have liked to have found out what it would have been like to return or to go. But it looks like a Thousand Light Years Away, performed by Chelsea Lee Greenwood. Lyrics by Nick Popovich, produced by Maddie Green. Uh, I forget who said it last stream, but someone said that they give you one extra key just in case uh, you locked yourself out somewhere. Yeah, that's true. They might continue it in Slime Rancher 2 because they left this one very open. For every pioneer on every new frontier. Be brave, be bold, and stay wiggly. So let's see what that achievement is. I got a lot of these. Uh, maybe it's at the bottom. Complete adventure mode and set out for what's next. Snare a hunter, Gordo. I don't think I found a Gordo. Purchase different toys. Oh, in a single game of slime ball? I haven't played slime ball. Place a tar on the number one slime stage. <laughs> Best of the worst. Oh, that's cute. 75,000 new bucks in rush mode? Oh, that's one of the game modes, right? Send an adorable chick to a fiery end, the same place you are now destined to go. You monster. Fill a pond on your ranch with at least five different types of slimes. Three different types of Largos in the same corral? I could do that real quick. Risky business. I got a mail from Hobson. Um... No one ate anything, right? We didn't. We didn't. Sh we didn't share. Share in plorts. Right, but Gordos are. Oh, I guess that's an alternative from getting all the food for them, right? But I feel like it was easier to. I wonder what slime that is. I feel like it was easier to just feed them than it was to capture one, you know? Let's see. So none of the rush mode stuff. I have at least 10 types of Largos on the ranch. I wonder how I could do 10 different types of Largos. Um, I don't know if I ever made a snare. I also don't know if I can do a snare because I don't think there's any Largos left. I did get a snare. 
or Gordos. I don't think I have any Gordos left to try to snare. I think I got them all. I mean, I can check real quick. Slime Rancher Gordo map. So there's the pink Gordo, the Phosphor Gordo. Oh, you know what? I don't think I got that Phosphor Gordo. Yeah, we can go try on the Phosphor Gordo. Uh, what do they eat? Q-berries? I don't know how much food I'm gonna need, so I'm just gonna get 50. Knew it. Knew it. Think you just plant them in the wild and a Gordo shows up? Really? I wouldn't have thought that was it. But yeah, you might be right. Where? I know it's over here somewhere. Oh, it's over there. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's try it both ways, I suppose. And then we'll go see what Hobson's got to say. Oh, maybe that's why they want me to find a hunter. Uh, a hunter Gordo. Is I just have to go plant one out where hunter Gordos would be. There is this one. Ooh, a violet slime lamp. Um, yeah, I guess I can't put them here. See, so yeah, I'll go put one down and I'll give it a shot. Let's see what this guy does. Oh, hey, he gives me another key. Yeah, I bet there was, there's probably plenty of keys out there that I just never discovered myself, you know? I also never did get all these treasure pods. New upgrade available. A single spare slime key just in case you can't seem to find the last one. Oh, that's nice. All right, so let's put one. Let's put it right here, shall we? Uh, novice slime snare. Oh, just requires one. All right, I don't know if maybe we go sleep and wait to see. I don't need you. All right, let's go read our mail. Hello, Beatrix. Just wanted to say thanks for taking care of the old ranch. I know I left it in a bit of a sorry state, and from what I hear, it's looking mighty fine these days. Makes me feel all warm and fuzzy knowing that it's in such good hands. As a little thank you, I've activated three secret vaults that I built years ago to stash a small fortune of mine. I had always planned on using it as walking around money in the great beyond, but I ain't needing for that no more. But you know me, I like a good adventure. I'm not telling where the vaults are located. Go explore. Vaults. 
Dude had vaults with money? I wouldn't even know where to start. All right, calm down, you guys. Where in the world would these secret vaults be? I mean, you know, I get it, you know, gotta explore. But still. Hey, there's a big pink slime buddy so now that they're there I gotta feed them they'll eat anything so I gotta get chickens I gotta get fruit no ah, no I need that rooster where did he go Give me that rooster. I don't think so. Um, but I only, I only say I don't think so because the keys have only ever been for the doors. Feed him other slimes, cannibalism. God, I wish. Ah, oh, a hidden jelly stone. Have I been over there? I think I have. Now I'm just trying to find enough, uh food to feed these little fellas. Like, there's part of me that wants to try and find these vaults, but the other part of me is like, eh. Oh, really? I can't feed you from that far away? Alright. I'm out of food, man. Oh, forgot about this one. Yeah, that's where I had planted the snare, was right there. Oh, you know, I have an idea where one of the vaults might be. <clears throat> Just an inkling. I don't know if it'll be right or not. There it is. Don't need any of that. All right, so now I just gotta remember, I think it's this way. Good luck, Vault Hunter. See, it is Borderlands. I have to find vaults. It all makes sense. I 
All right, let's see if my intuition was correct. I was gonna, I was gonna feed him chickens, but he disappeared. Actually, hold on a second. Yeah, okay. So, We just need to... we need to get higher. We need to get higher! Higher! Darn tootin' my intuition was right. Okay. We'll just we'll let this recharge real quick. <laughs> oh, hey, look. Yeah, you were right, Bryce. It's right here. Good job. Oh, where am I now? It is unknown. Ah, but that is why I do I do need slime keys apparently. So glad I had a spare. All right, what kind of riches does he have up here? Yeah. Oh wow, look at all these pods. I don't want to activate that just yet. I do want to activate these. Gold plorts. Dude's just got straight up gold plorts hanging out. He's been a rancher for a while, I guess. Yeah, that was mighty impressive, Bryce. I still don't think I can make gold Largos, but I can try. Yo, Hobson, what's that about? You just drop an angry pink stone Largos on me? Rude? Quite rude, my dude. Oh my lord! He's got so many. I'm not even gonna be able to open all of these while I'm here. Cause I can't carry m more than 50. All right, so let's go find a pink slime and see if we can turn it into a Largo. Eat my gold plort. Nah, he doesn't want it. Wow, 2,500, dang. 
but they're selling for 371. Look at that bank roll in. No, uh, you can't switch to tank two because it counts it as all the same thing. So like, I'll show you with just this stuff. It counts it still in as one. You can hold a max of 50 of one thing. And that's it. Uh, we'll buy. Actually, no. I wanna. I wanna buy more of these upgrades. Ah, can't get the overgrowth upgrade yet. Yeah, it's very, very particular, very specific, but also very neat. And I think, I think that's a, uh, a good place to stop Slime Rancher. We did quite a bit. We got the ending, we got credit roll. Now we want to change this over to Pyre. And I may or may not want my controller. See what kind of game it is. 